Oh, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? This is Demo Storm, and we're back with the wonderful This Land is My Land. Uh, we started a new game. Basically, my name on the last one was terrible. Now I can run! I don't have negative 500 stamina, so I had zero stamina on my last character. I think that was the issue with running and things like that. I'm not really sure. But, uh, yeah, we started a new game. This one, this character, I named him Beta. Got way more buffs. So when you name a character in the beginning of the game, you get, like, uh, buffs and things. I like to show it, but it's just so loud. Very loud. I'll let you guys experience that for yourselves. Looking for the perfect name. If you want to get into it, the start page should be down below. Just going to collect a couple of things and get our, get our resistance on its way. All right, since I started with some XP, I'm going to get the... The hunter bow right away. Hunter's bow, you need sinew. Yeah, okay. So the game wants me to instantly, you know, craft our basics here. Oh, I clicked out of my game by accident, I guess. Sorry about that. That's a fort. We don't want to mess with the fort right away. We have another uh, friendly camp over there that we might be able to get to join us. We also have our horses this time, which is nice. You guys like leaning up against the horse on top of a log? Real cool. Uh huh. There we go. Oh, I want to set these guys to do things. All right, so start this off. Can you guys gather? Two of you. See, this always closes for me. It doesn't close for everybody else. This is just like a glitch with me. Like, what am I doing wrong? Stop it. Wood. Send. I sent them to go get wood. Should be good. We also have 500 points. You can see that right here. Skills. I want bow arc accuracy. Gonna come in a lot of help later on. Alright, start adventuring our area a little bit. I want to start heading towards these guys though. See what they need to join our resistance here. Also, if I see a deer, I'm gonna hunt it. Oh, we can make the other bow. Little tutorial pop ups. There's the road. If I follow this road and then take a left up here. We don't want to go to the fort. We're not ready for a fort. Assault. Our guys don't have bows and things like that. Oh, uh, while well, I'm at it. Oh. Uh, add camp inventory. I need you guys to make 15 bows and. Arrows, 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 arrows. What an arrows, please. There. So now the, with the resources they get, they should be making those things. This is where I should take my left. Crossroads. And head on up here. Alright. Due to change shoulders. If you're one of those people. <laughs> I've never been one of the people that like switch shoulders that much. Maybe for a lean of some sort. Right, these guys will actually have resources for me to take too. Or neutral. Beta, will you join the fight? We have three camps. Oh, Jesus. All right, so that's going to take a little bit of work. That's always different, too, so sometimes you can get lucky and <laughs> they just join. So we need to set up a lot of camps to really get them to join us. We also have guys over there. We're going to go assault the camp first thing. I would love to find a deer... Build a different bow. Because this first bow is ugh, not accurate enough. Doesn't do enough damage either. I 
entering Fort Churchill area. You know, we're not gonna take that on. Probably should build a secondary bow as well. That would be a good idea. These bows do break. They break all the time on me. Especially in combat. I, I seem to get into that problem a lot. Alright, let's see. Here we go. There's the camp. Duck down. Keep some stealth going. I actually make any of these traps yet? Yeah, that one requires a little bit. Buffalo horn. I don't have buffalo. Paralyzing spike trap. Let's just learn it. Peyote leave. Wood rope. Yeah, I haven't seen any peyote. Peyote? Peyote, whatever it is. Who sees me? You gotta be careful. There's a dog. I gotta be careful of that. There's a guy peeing over there. One down. Don't see me, don't see me, don't see me. We're playing a good stealth theme right now. Oh, we just killed the Baxon. Oh, we got him. We got him. So we got a basic bow, which is way better. That's a good find. All right. Where's all my kills? You're dead. I'm just gonna pick this hickory so it's out of the way. You're dead. He fell inside here. Look at that. That's a good find. Good stuff right there. Yeah, we got quite a bit of stuff from this. So if I want to, I can bring that back to my camp. I just want to find all the kills that I just got. There's one. I think I got them all. If not, it happens. Alright, cool. Group from Fort Churchill. Really? I could, like, ambush them. Let me see. Tell everything you want. Stun him out. There we go. Got them too. He's like drunk. So we can intimidate him? This guy's just drunk. So I'm going to intimidate him. Actually, I'm going to cancel that. I was going to intimidate him. But honestly, he might have good gear. He's experienced. 
Nope, bad karma. Oh well. What are you, unskilled? What do you got? We can uh, intimidate him. And you're, if you're wondering what I'm saying on experience stuff, down in the bottom right, the other guy was experienced. This guy's unskilled. So we're going to intimidate him. He's now going to run off and never join again. It won't give us negative karma either. So as you can see, we just smashed the group. It's just going to run off and not return to camp. Or he shouldn't at least. Group from Fort Churchill vanished. Yeah, we got them both. Nice. That was a good ambush right there. Got 579 skill points again. We'll keep working. We now have this new bow. Obviously, I need to go get my horse. Well, that's a good thing. That's a real nice thing to do. I'm going to go get my horse and we're going to search around the area some more. If I can ambush like groups coming out of there, here and there, maybe cut down the population. I don't know if how that if that's how it works, but we're gonna try. I could also ride back to camp and give my guys guns. That's a good idea. That way our warriors have guns to use. And I think that will help. Also I got a couple of extra bows, so gotta be careful they added fall damage to horses. So you got to make sure where you're running and stuff. The game is updating well. I mean, they keep updating and updating, updating. It's real nice. All right, horse. Please don't take fall damage. I know, it's hard to go up and down rocks. That's real cool that they had a group come out and I just slam it. Get another weapon. Yeah, I want to make sure that my warriors always have weapons on hand. Especially when I send them out to gather. You'd be surprised how many times they just die to a bear or a wolf or something attacking them. So you got to make sure your warriors are always kitted out. You can set up patrols too to protect the camp. So if there's anybody near, you can, they'll kill them. You can also sell it, send out some hunters. Alright, we're at camp stuff. That log's gone. They must have taken it. Alright, now that we're at camp, we should be able to... Yeah, we can give it to them. Flintlock rifle versus a regular rifle. This does a lot more damage, but it's really loud. That's 20 cal versus a... 75. I'm gonna give him this. This shoots 20 cal. We have some. Give them the egg. And I'm going to give them some wooden arrows. Here's a wooden bow. Here's that bow. And we got one warrior here. Oh, I need two camps to actually set up a patrol. Um, we got one guy who can gather. Give that to the warriors. Give them the arrows. And then go get some sinew, please. Oh no, the camp's technically overrun because I sent everyone out. It's fine, these guys are coming back. Or at least they should be. Real nice. Alright. I'm going to ride out. Hopefully that doesn't end my resistance because I just messed that up. I don't know if it's a glitch or something. Probably not. Ooh, wild horses. Yeah, if you want, you can tame those. That's cool that those are running around. I 
I have no idea how you tame a wild horse. You must have to sneak up on it without, like, freaking it out. I have no idea. Alright, there's a deer. If I really want to send you. I'll send my, my warriors. will do it. We're on a quest to go that way. I want to clear out any little camps nearby. Get some weapons and start giving them to our warriors and things like that. It'd be real nice. Hopefully they bring back enough wood and stuff too. Uh, start building rope. You can start settling more camps, getting more people. You know, building building your army. Your resistance would be the right word. There. Mark the next camp. So the camp we just assaulted earlier was only three, which was or four. Way easier to clear out than one that may have seven, eight, nine, ten, ten people. Forts I haven't even experienced how many people are in a fort. Woods camp area. Alright, we can see it from here. That's a lot bigger than I want it to be. So we're in an interesting predicament here. It's like a wooden camp. Keep her head down and hopefully get the right persons. That worked actually really well. Alright, we want to pull the guards with the big guns, obviously. Alright, we got ones breaking off. Probably going to pee. He's got a rifle, so I want to drop him with a stealth kill. Drop the guys with the big guns. He didn't even come. <laughs> Grab to one wooden bow, send group to gather wood. I don't even know if that's my camp's name. Gotta have to be quick. <laughs> Another pistol. Some ammo. Nice. Let me grab this. He's got a rifle too. Enemy. Uh. I think we got him in time before the call out. <laughs> oh, there we go. Perfect. That was a six shooter. That's what I want.
Doing pretty good in the clearing. I'm getting better at stealth. Overloaded. Oh no. We'll go through our inventory afterwards. Do we clear this? It's clear. Okay. So we're gonna loot this up. We are overloaded. Yeah, that was really actually really, really good for us. Usually I wouldn't land all that. We break down the inventory that we just gathered in a second. So if you wanted to, you can poison the meal. Right. Just loot up everything, and then I'll pick what I need and what I can drop. That'll just ride the horse, hopefully, back to camp. That usually works, too. Usually. 32 cal. Yeah, I'm super overloaded. Skill points, though, we have a 1,000. Real nice. So I could take bow accuracy. I could take weapon damage. More health. Maximum weight plus 10. We are way over that. I would take that if we were close. You can get some scouting of spyglass. Improved intimidation. Reels more territory around me. Endurance. Uh, better grabbing. Yeah, they make grab based on health now. Nullify. Or karma. Find rare animal parts when hunting. That's actually really good. Chance of finding more meat, sinew when skinning animals. Improved chance of finding more wood and leaves. Increased knife damage. What a few skills. I'm going to take bow accuracy. I know it seems kind of crazy, but. <laughs> When the arrow goes flying off when I'm aiming at a head, it's just, I need a better chance of hitting the head. We just cleared this place out pretty good, though. I will say so. Oh, there's some sinew. Nice. And I gotta go walk over to my horse. What does it say? How's our camp doing? We built one bow. We have no arrows yet. Not bad, though. Alright, let's start moving towards our horse. Let me check. We got so many rifles out of that. Some nice pistols here. We got my revolver that I wanted. Yeah, we gotta drop off these weapons at camp. Because if we can drop those weapons off camp, we're literally loading our warriors with bullets. Oh. Where did he come from? Oh, he's walking from another camp, probably. We got more guys coming. Jesus. I'm not ready for this. What is this? Yeah, they're walking between camps here. That's a problem. Start moving towards our horse. I probably should have started looting after I rode the horse over here. Yeah, they're definitely moving from that other camp. Skill points, though. I'm glad that we're building up quite a supply of skill points here. You can learn all different recipes. I'm going to start working with traps, too. Um, as you guys know, the stealth is everything in this game so far. But we're going to end here. I'm going to go drop off everything off camp. I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And let me know if you want to see more. Let me know if you got the game, too.
because let me know what you put your name in as and what you got for bonus. Anyways, guys, have a wonderful day.